Goddess Isis was worshipped as a primordial goddess in Egypt, ancient Greece and the wider Mediterranean lands for over 7,000 years. Isis represents everything that is to do with aligning with your true purpose with bringing everything into your life to unlock the power, the authenticity, and really your divine contribution to humanity and the earth. I've been connected to Goddess Isis for a very long time because I've always been obsessed with the iconography that is connected to Isis. The beautiful Ankh symbol is something that I have just wanted to connect with since childhood, and I never really knew why. But as I went through my life, and as I opened up to the spiritual feminine, it became clearer to me that I was connected to the Ankh, and I was connected to Isis, and the ancient Egyptian realm, because this goddess really wanted to open up my purpose. I didn't know what my purpose was until I just started taking those daily steps, those moment by moment steps, towards what I really dreamed of doing. So, Isis really unlocks your dreams. She puts fire under your dreams and gives you the courage to put them into action. The other really interesting part of working with Goddess Isis that you may not think at first is connected to your purpose or your passion is that she works on healing your relationship with your mother, with your own biological mother in this lifetime. So it's very focused upon your own connection with her. Of course, my relationship with my own mother required a lot of healing because she left the earth plane when I was very small. So I've been really taken into doing a lot of work on my relationship with my own mother. How that relates to you can be from one extreme to the other. But what Isis will do is take you past any limitations that your own mother may have put in place for her own life. That means she will help you expand beyond the parameters of your own mother's choices. And as you heal your relationship with your own mother in whatever way you are called to do so, you not only liberate a lot of energy for yourself, you're able to stand on your own two feet, take responsibility for your own choices, you know, be your own inner authority. It's very important to do that when you're connecting to your purpose. But also, there's an old saying, a spiritual saying really, that says that as you heal the relationship with your own mother, you heal your own ancestral feminine line. You heal seven generations backwards, and seven generations forwards. And that's really important food for thought when connecting with this powerful goddess. So when Isis, goddess Isis, is connecting with you to ignite your purpose, you're gonna to need to get in touch with what it is that you dream of. What do you dream of doing, of being, as living as? How do you dream of contributing to our world? Write them down, stick pictures of them on a board, speak about them, express them without censoring yourself, without listening to that critical voice that says, oh, you'll never be able to do that. You'll, there's no way you'll be able to create that. Listen to your dreams, but then listen to the very, very next step that you are given. And it may not be what your mind expects, it may not be what your ego wants, but it, there will be one clear step that you can take. It might just be meditate. It might be write down all your dreams and hand it over to the universe. Ask Goddess Isis to enter your life and guide you day by day, step by step, breath by breath into being a living conduit for your soul's dreams.